Very good. Mm -hmm. Good. So. I'm great. Thank you very much. I'm pissed that I have to get on a plane tomorrow. Thanks so much. But, I'm you know. so sorry. What can you do? <laughs> Bonnie, yeah. you're from? Bonnie Lawford Tribute, Canada. Uh, you want me to fly the plane? I would. You know what? I'd be, you know, I don't know about Whip Whitaker, but I'd be kind of cool <laughs> to have Denzel Washington flying my plane. Uh, you might want Whip Whitaker. You may not want me. <laughs> Denzel, I don't know. What's your secret? How do, on earth do you make every role that you take on look so effortless? Well, I mean, you work hard to make it look easy. I mean, you, you and you have to you have to work for, you have to work from a place of relaxation. So, you know, if they catch you acting too much, then you're not you're not really doing your job. Yeah. Well, you did your job in this, and you, uh, man, he is a character that, you know, we're rooting for him. Should we we be rooting for him? Because what he's doing is bad, but you made him sympathetic. You you know I've heard people saying that they're, they're rooting for him and uh, why 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 are you rooting for him? Let me ask you that. Why? Because he's a good guy deep down, and yeah. he's, he's an addict, and it's a problem, and right, it's a sickness. Right, right. But yet he's getting on a plane every day, and he's taking everybody's lives into their hands. <laughs> Not a good thing. Not a good thing. But yet he proved himself. Right. And and you know I think ultimately he com he comes clean. You know, no pun intended. He comes clean, and and uh, and you know, I think that that day was the worst day of his life, yeah. but it was the beginning of the of a new day in his life. Yeah. Um, what kind of preparation do you have to do? You obviously must have sat in cockpits. You obviously did that kind of training, and do you mm -hmm. listen to those black boxes and to to get into the psyche of a pilot? Uh, I, I didn't listen to the black boxes so much, but we did work with the. Uh, MD-80, uh, McDonnell Douglas uh, flight simulators, which was great, and, and you do takeoffs and, uh, you know, learning your, your instruments and how to keep the plane balanced, and it's not easy. No. Mm -mm. I mean, it's got to be one of the hardest jobs, I think, out there. It's crazy, yeah. For but, it, you know, it requires lots, you know, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of hours to really you know, to, to be on that level. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, you know, at this point in your career, Denzel, what is it about a script that you look at it and you go, yeah, this is what I'm going to do, or this is one I'd like to direct. You know, how do you choose at this point? They choose me because there's not that very many good scripts. And when I read this one, usually you know if it's a fast read, you know, if you're really excited about each page, you know. And, and this was one of those scripts that, that I just said, wow, okay. Yeah, huge challenge, yeah. especially playing and an addict. When, and, 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 and yeah, and that too. And actually, coming off of uh, the, the last two scripts that my agent gave me before he passed away was Safe House mm. and Flight. And they were so different, you know, and one was more action-y or, or whatever. And, and, and this one, out of a, it, it, I, I won't say it was darker. That's why I was really surprised when, when uh, 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 the director decided to come on and, and be a part of the film, because, you know, Bob has made such big, you know, popular films, and, and, and then he's a pilot as well. Yeah. So I thought that was a perfect combination for, I knew he would make something bigger in, in a sense than and even was on the page. Yeah, well, Bigger than the amount of money we had to, to yeah. make it with, too, because we didn't have a whole lot of money. Yeah, well, it, it, you know, it, you just, it's outstanding. It makes you think, and uh, I'm strapping myself in extra tight tomorrow morning. Yeah. <laughs> and if you want to fly the plane, Air Canada, 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, okay? <laughs>